my beautiful buddies and welcome to the channel for a review on kits. We have the Country Kitchen, the Throwback Fit, and the bust the dust kit that we are taking a look at today so i am doing this kind of like in the form of a speed build and i'm going to share with you like a little lookbook kind of thing um later on in the video um this speed build is also going in my save file fyi so like i just did the whole house just to kind of like kill two birds with one stone but this is basically how i feel about the kits so they're about five dollars each um usd and i think that not every kit is going to enthuse every person. Um, now, I was lucky enough to get my codes from the EA Game Changers program, so thanks to them. Um, but however, I like I said, I just don't think that every single one is going to suit every person. Like, for example, the Country Kitchen set will be good if you're a builder, um, throwback fit if you're like a cast person, um, more likely like a Max's Match cast person, um, and then we have the Dust Bus kit that if you're like a gameplay person. Now, personally, my personal favorite is actually the throwback fit. Um, I think the building set is really pretty. Um, personally, the only one I feel like that could have been cheaper than five dollars is honestly the the um, the bust the dust one. Just because while I can appreciate realism in The Sims, I just feel like something as simple as like vacuuming kind of could almost have been like in parenthood or even like made into a bigger pack of like laundry day and to do like that more like realistic mundane kind of tasks um and i think it's like a cool aspect of it like something else for your sims to do um but personally i don't know i just i feel like that one could have been like three dollars almost even four i know in other countries are like nearly like seven eight dollars so i just don't know how that would like you know like how you guys feel about it like what which one is your favorite again i really like i really like the items i think none of them are ugly or like not worth the money i just think like the concept of kits i feel like i would like to see how they're delivered over time i guess like i personally know for a fact that if they were to make like a wedding kit that people would really love this or even like a bedroom set kit because we haven't really gotten like a stuff pack like around like bedroom sets or something like that that could be interesting or nice to a world kit where they like literally just like gave us like empty worlds or something like that that would be really amazing um so that's personally what i would like to see from kits in the future um but yeah i guess my consensus of it is that if you're gonna buy buy one right now i would recommend the throwback fit if you're a cast person um and yeah that one was my favorite so the country kitchen one i thought it was cute i definitely liked it i thought it was perfect for this kind of build because it was kind of like a cottagey feel especially for the safe file because i'm make making over windenburg into veronaville right now um and this is kind of like a like forty five thousand dollar like starter ish kind of home um but of course i don't think it's gonna like suit every single build like I don't know maybe it's just me but like if this was like a modern kit style kitchen i would have like loved it like that would have been easily my favorite but maybe it's just because like i feel like we kind of gotten a lot of like the cozy cutesy vibes especially with like you know like the um the knitting pack like recently and and what else was there i don't know like i just feel like there's a lot in this kind of like cutesy like cottagey style that i'm just kind of like craving more modernish kind of things but maybe that's just because what i build more often again i like it i think it's cute but it's it's not like a ride or die set i think for me right now i have to be honest but yeah does that mean that the objects are not quality i think they're I think they're very quality and they're very cute again i feel like it just kind of depends on what you're building and like kind of like what your style is so that's just kind of like how how it is in my mind um otherwise i guess i could show you guys some of the screenshots that i've taken also do something i should share with you guys is that i've also made a tiktok um i'm just called rosebud official there so if you guys would like to go and follow me um 
please do. I think I'll start to put like my TikTok name in my descriptions of my videos along with my other things. Um, because yeah, I've been having lots of fun there. Just something, something new I've been trying. Cause as you guys know, I have been trying to do some little changes here and there. Um, and yeah also do this is like my first video too since i'm seeing the new update with the um the custom content like update that we got for free and oh my god i love the objects that they that they added they were so freaking cute which if you haven't seen them yet in game please go ahead and do so but yeah please tell me guys whether you guys are buying any of the packs do you guys think it's worth it um like i said I think it just depends on the person and what you like. We come with five different vacuums for Busted Dust since I haven't really talked about that one. There is two new aspirations with it. Again, I feel like the aspirations are kind of good for like side characters because they're kind of like very, very like kind of like basic things like clean the floor five times, like hire a cleaning service, like things like that. So I think it's again good for some easy quick points but it's like nothing like really super riveting i think as far as like aspirations go um but yeah i do think it's cute i think it's not i do think it's cute like i said i don't think any of these things are like ugly or horrible or anything like that but it's like nothing extremely ordinary like extraordinary i guess in my opinion um but yeah it's cute it's cute that's all i really have to say about it um also too Please make sure you guys subscribe to me down below. Um, I'm putting in the screenshots right now because I kind of forgot to do it while I did it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little overview. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, bye, bye. I don't want to let you down. It's the only thing I think about every morning. You know my life ain't figured out. But I promise if you stick around it'll never get boring We'll spend nights, cheap red wine Look at flats even though we can't afford them I don't wanna let you down I don't wanna lose you now Will you stay? Even when you wanna walk away When times get bad We can learn to love what we have I don't wanna let you down Oh, 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 oh,